back at it again, baby. I swear, before the game, man, she gonna kiss me. I feel it. Hey, well, I'm about to get another stem, baby. Oh. Can't go wrong with more stems. Well, we survived our first storm together. Yes, we did. I'm glad we got to see each other again. How long are you staying on Jeddah? I don't know. But I am excited to see Grease. How is he these days? Not bad. He opened up a cantina. Hyloon Saloon. He named it after his great grandma. Nothing's more important to Grease than family. Dumped right away. Yo, we really about to get the band back together, though. But I feel like one of us going. It better not be Mary. I feel like one of us going to die. It better not be. Oh, it might be my pop. Oh, it might be the pop, bitch. It might be the bondage, but... Hello, my friend. It's so very good to see you again. Wait, I thought he was dead. Wait, what? Master Cordova. It's an honor. I never thought I'd meet you in person. The honor is mine, Cal. Seer has told me everything. I thought Seer, I thought it was going to be you Seer. You have demonstrated the door. great bravery and wisdom in the face of overwhelming adversity. You chose well. <whistles> well, <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> the Empire has claimed the ruins. We'll have to find another rendezvous point. Unfortunate. But at least the storm covered your tracks. Come, come, let me escort you inside. Master Cordova, did you find the Zepho? Only faint traces of their passage heading deep into the unknown regions. Sorry to hear that. As it goes. I could have sworn he was dead in the first game, but... Hey, he's hey, hi, how you doing? How uh, how do you do? Ultimately, that failure inspired me to seek out other Jedi survivors. That search led me back to my old apprentice. How have you been faring, Cal? That doesn't sound good. I've had a few scrapes, but I'm still breathing. And I'm glad for it. I heard some news about a Jedi terrorist on Coruscant not long ago. You were on Coruscant? Uh -huh. Well, the Mantis looks like it's seen better days. You should see the other guys. This base is well hidden. Yes. Well, the Empire's presence has grown these past years. They are much too strong to fight directly, but we do what we can. It is critical, of course, that our work remains secret. What work exactly? Better to ask Seer yourself. Meanwhile, Marin and I will greet our new arrival. So, how was the desert? Cold, stormy, and too many Imperials. Mm, not my preferred weather forecast. But more common by the day. Where did you weather the storm? A cave past the old market. Our Spamel friend showed us the way. You have a habit for making new friends wherever you go. A survival instinct. I intercepted some Imperial communication. Your reputation is growing. Was there fear in their voices? 
Quite a bit, yes. Good. Time to see my ball, bitch. Let's get it. Um, yeah, yeah, I'm going this way. Let's go this way. Uh, raggy. Uh, okay, so maybe if I come back through again. Uh, time to see my ball, bitch. Use this lift from here. Reeves must be in the kitchen. We'll meet up with him later. Master Cordova and I will wait for Grease. Go speak with Sir. I want to. I, I don't know where to go. Is that supposed to go this way? Went that way. This way. Am I glitched? Yo. Just keep trying. It's not like Brother Armai has to break contact. Cal Kestis. Welcome to Jeddah. I knew the storm wouldn't deter you. You're rebuilding the temple archives. And we're trying. As long as this knowledge remains, the legacy of the Jedi survives. It's incredible. Hmm. But something tells me there's more to this than just hollow books. Yes. We're a part of a network known as the Hidden Path. We provide safe passage and new identities to those who have been persecuted by the Empire. Hunted by the Empire, like... like Jedi survivors? Very few of us remain. But yes, and for sensitives and those who help them. Why didn't you tell me? <laughs> you never asked. Besides, I hear you've been busy making yourself the Empire's most wanted. I wanted to prove to the galaxy that the Empire isn't invulnerable. That you can resist. That you have to fight if things are gonna get better. But then they just listen to the propaganda and they pretend they're free anyways. Hmm. Yeah. You chose a hard path. And it hasn't made a difference. Well, while the Empire's trained its eyes on you, we've been able to build the network. Find allies. And save lives. When you left, you'd just given up. I was wrong. Cal. 
how you were just a child when they sent you off to war. You know, there was a time when I remember that the Jedi were more than just weapons. But we both have our roles to play in this struggle. But that's why I'm here. Seer. Well, you get a load of this. Hey, Seer. You can't say it ain't short of personality, <laughs> but kind of creepy, though. <laughs> well, it's good to see you two, Grease. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh, hello, uh, BD. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> so, how was your time in the desert? The storm covered our tracks, but the Empire destroyed one of your speeders. It's a small price to pay for everybody's safe arrival. And who's this? This is Bodokuna. He is a friend. It's so nice to finally meet you. Uh, this hunk of trouble! <laughs> hey! We're all together! <laughs> yes. Now, what brings you all to Jeddah? We're searching for a lost planet. Tantalor, you ever heard of it? It's on the other side of a deadly nebula called the Kobo Abyss. Well, our archives are far from complete, but I'm sure Master Cordova was up to the task. With pleasure. The trouble is, we're not the only ones looking for this place. I knew this was sounding too easy. The guy's name is Dagon Gera. He was a Jedi. Now he leads a band of raiders on the Outer Rim. There's an old temple there. Dagon intends to reclaim it. A Jedi temple out of the reach of the Empire could mean that there's information there that we don't have in the archive. I believe I have something. <laughs> oh, you're too kind, BD. <laughs> I'll start with the bad news. Oh, boy. This guy knows his I wish audience. I could understand you. I found no information related to crossing the Kobo Abyss. However, I found two mentions of this Dagon Gera. He had a retreat on Kobo, and records show him frequently visiting a laboratory on its moon. Okay, we'll check him out. If you find anything, bring it to me. I am happy to assist further. Thank you. Both of you. You're welcome, Cal. I hope you find what you're searching for. May the Force be with you. And with you. May the Force be with us. Reach channel on the shadows. I will escort you back to the Mantis. So you're oh, not yeah, joining us? I cannot. Hey, Cal. Hold on. I've had this since I started freelancing. Got me out of some bad situations, and I figured it might do the same for you. It's Marin, right? Well, I could get another one if you think you might want. No need. Both. <laughs> yeah, you're you're good. Okay. The master always frowned upon using blasters. You once said it blink. wasn't the weapon that makes you a Jedi. I got a blick. It's us against the galaxy, Cal. We've got to use every advantage we can find against the Empire. Thanks, Bo. Now, I'll show you how to use it. A real stormtrooper won't stay still. Gotta start somewhere. There you go. Not bad, Jedi. So, how long have you been working for Seer? I do not work for Seer. Right. My mistake. Relax, Cal. Just concentrate and pull the trigger. Impressive. 
Think you got it, Cal. So where are we headed first? Back to Kobo? Or it's Moon? Let's hit the Moon Laboratory first. All right. Maybe we can find something there to help us cross the Abyss. It's nice seeing you again, Marin. You too, Cal. Good luck. Perhaps I will still be here when you return. Hope so. I hope I can customize my gun. If I can customize my gun, oh damn. Let's mix it up. Oh, it's L's. <laughs> Yo, it's L's. No. Not your typical blaster. Great time to change up our equipment. I can't change BG1. Oh, now I can. Change his color. New look for you, BD. Same great attitude. I wish I could understand what he's saying, dude. All right, let's go. Okay, let's pick our next destination. Going for the moon. Down for the moon of Kobo. Maybe What's those anchorites say? aren't so bad after all. Didn't you call them weirdos? That was before Seer told me they're helping those poor refugees hide from the Empire. That right? Yeah. Working with the group called the Hidden Path. Real hush-hush stuff. So keep it in the family. Understood. Seems like you've got a nice crew. Well, former crew. You know. Do I? So, Cordova thinks we'll find out how to cross the Abyss by tracking down Dagon's old haunts? That's right. You know anything about this laboratory on the moon, Grease? What am I, a tour guide? I'm a busy Latero. No time to visit broken moons. First Jetta, now this. Oh, believe me, moons are nothing but trouble. Jetta's a moon. Had no idea. This is your captain speaking, inviting you to grab some seats so we can land. Smidge rusty. You? A little restless, but we'll be fine. Oh, listen to you, Mr. Optimistic. Hmm. Hey, you want to do me a favor? Cut it out. You're giving me a stomach ache. Sure, it's how you're cooking? <laughs> what was that? We're almost there. Locals say the moon's haunted. Couldn't have put this laboratory in a sunnier place? No kidding. 
But if we find something here that'll help us navigate the Kobo Abyss, so be it. The way Grease tells it, the Abyss is a ship graveyard. And now we're on a lunar graveyard. A lot of graveyards. A lot of graveyards. So not that way. I really think there's something past the abyss. Centauri Cree does. I suppose that's enough for the council. operational after all this time. Stay alert. We need to find that lab. for this. feeling? Yeah, me too.
looking around, do they? Come on, buddy. Place what? Place what? Oh, gotta unlock this. BD, tell me stem. MVD. Good save. so much, buddy.
Let me see. You gotta check it out. This is strange. Wait, what? What just happened? Oh, what? What's this? Defeat the Horde of Battle. Drum. That again. Fix it. Whatever I did, it doesn't seem to have helped. I'm still here. No, I'm beating this. I'm beating this. <laughs>